yes it's six o'clock so of course you know it's time for the world famous review show okay today before we start the review we're going to have a very 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 important interview with a new artist named Ajani from Adaba Entertainment now Ajani if you're on the live comment something let me see Adaba Entertainment is a new record label coming out of Galtigo Bay and Kingston Jamaica represented for England and the United States of America now you don't know you have good good production you have um, damaged music you have a couple labels from Galtigo Bay you have Star Plus which is Fox them you understand and now we have Araba Entertainment with artists like Ajani Zee? Ajani is a youth when I review him song and I post him song on my page because I do some promotion for them but you know anything when I not like me not promote if, if it never bad I would promote it you understand what I say? so of course you know it's a new movement and we appreciate new talent you know especially when they have potential so Oh, the dark, someone turn on some light, man. The dark. Yeah, they're the wrong side of the kitchen, brother. Go yeah. on the next part where light has shine. We yeah. have the can't see of you. So I shut it over here, this one. So find somewhere with better lighting. So you have to be clear? Yeah, I have to see you clear, brother. Uh, Remember to be early gone and now. We have to see you. Yeah, we have to see you a little better now. Look, you see me now? Yeah, so them beer like the stain of them big house, them man. They, them not so bright. <laughs> you see me? You know when we live in a ghetto, a hundred watt bulb we have in a living room, you know, man. Yeah. Bright like a man in star. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, um, this is one of the newest artists um, entering dance hall, and you know, Where's they give him approval. <laughs> My pass him already named Ajani from Adaba, Adaba Entertainment. Minium. <laughs> All right, Ajani. Fully. First thing, because you know when a new artist has entered the realm, a foot of hyper interview, yeah. This no. gone viral by a man. First more, you introduce yourself to the people, them original name, artist name, and then tell them which part of Jamaica you're born and grown hill from. Well, you don't know Ajani. Ajani Ibert, you dig? Yeah. And my boy in a Jubilee Hospital for all who never know that. You dig? Oh, so you're a Kingstonian? Yeah. So how oh, oh, you end up a mobile, you know? Well, you don't know. Links and links, you see me? I will move around. So you, you presently live a mobile, you know? Yeah, right now. But St. Thomas is really my place. Is you see what I say? Because so, yeah. I move from Kingston and go to St. Thomas to spend most of my time. So you come like say, St. Thomas. Which part of St. Thomas? I have a place out the name. Berlin. Big up Berlin. I like oh. Berlin. When I like what you can. Big up. You All right. So, so basically, you're born a Jubilee, which is public hospital, if not people don't know. Yeah. And then, which community you did live them time when you live at Kingston? Augustone. Okay, so it's an Augustone Tavern, Papin, also Jai, them place there. I'm a town, them place there too. Ajani is a natural vibe still, you see me? So we, we, we are around, you see me? I say? No, no, we just, we're, we're more of the people that have a full understanding of your origins and your roots. No matter yeah. where you've been, you know, no matter where you go and where you're propelled to, you were born at a certain place. The okay. essence of where you're born, you can't leave it. Sure. Me born a cassava piece, it can't change. When me born a jubilee, a cassava piece me go. That's yeah. where you're from. You understand? I've been all over the world. But I guess where I come from. See? Yeah. Um, I don't really want to ask you age. I don't know me that I stay here. Roger! 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 Roger!
fully active man. I like people who check in for the life, big up man. I like August on my life. Cassavas is peace people, them see me, more be a people, them. Is it cold, Jimmy? You get me? All right, you look like a, 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 a fairly young youth to me. At what age you decide, say, you wanted to be an artist? Like, when you start, realize, say, you have artistic skills for do lyrics and them something. All right, naturally, naturally, my born with it, you know, so it just grew like it develop from, from a tender age. You see, me? see from, from a growing up, you can say, oh, I'm put them to line of speed and, you see, me? it's a lyric start. Yeah. At what age? Yeah, but you yeah, actually know at some point say, all right, because then tell you, Jesus loved me this time and, and look a regular something we sing to lullabies and hymns. But when did you realize that I can formulate my own lyrics and make it into a song? I'm going to want to do this. From me about 10, 11. Mm. Okay. So, you remember your first experience of like performing like Radar right school or somebody a beat Dexter or DJ. When, when was your first moment of performance like an audience? So you say, yo, me a perform. I see same place in Berlin, big up all the Berlin people. I'm saying. Berlin yeah. is a place you used to keep some, some look at ghetto bashing other people. Some talent them fall out and some show them talent. You get what I say? So I kinda I kinda I kinda um basically right this on the start with <clears throat> Yeah but like like me now me bust from two thousand and one Zin me start find and uh, appreciate my talent at about thirteen Zin you know say yo at this moment at what age you did that first performance then? Oh professionally okay okay it was summer season. It was summer season when I realized, say, yo, I have to take this thing serious and, you get me, I say, push it professionally. Summer season has been a Beanie Man show, right? Yeah, 2018. So that was the first stage you ever performed, man? No, as I tell you before, I used to work out of the ghetto watch stage, you get me, I say? Yeah, so more you share that experience here with me when I reached summer season yet. Yeah. The experience of the first time you enter in a stage and know it's a crowd out there, so I mean, I got DJ for the first time. Walk with you that experience. Well, get to watch. Get to watch them. It was like, it was like the, the, the young sensation I followed up. You get me? Yeah. Yeah. All of Berlin know it. No, 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 me want to know, me not know, me want to know the first, the first one. Me not talk about all of them, but them know, so yeah, you are the year of sensation. Now, the first one, where yeah. you go out and perform in front of the audience and how you did feel and what was the experience like? I right, can't give in details the very, very first time I go out there and perform as it was a lot, but I can't give when we perform on summer season. On summer season. No. No, a journey, man. You have to can tell me the first time in your life when you take up, say, you a DJ and the first time you say, all right, and yes, sir, I'm going to perform and people out there and you're there backstage and you see people them and you're there around there how you feel before you go out there how you feel when you're out there how you feel when you start DJ how the people them react to you. You have to can walk me through that. That's unforgettable. Any star at all, them, that, that never come out of your breath. Shit. And that, that experience there more, more, more understand, more over that experience there. Dumb as sizzle. I'm not going to stop saying that because that's the experience. You know what I'm mean? saying? Mean? So you never sing on a stage before summer season? Yeah, but I tell you so I can't get in details about them. Them time they be young and it's a long so basically, I say you forget your first performance. No, I never forgot. I just can't get in details. Why? You tell me why you remember what I eat. I eat more a year. I don't want you to go to the yet. Summer season is a big show, my brother. When they're done, I've looked at the name of Bill already. I don't want you to hear the first. When you know, say, yes, I eat this. And at the test of time, this. I want you to I can't tell you the first one for me, you know. I can't forget it. So. 
more you want me through that one day. Because me and you there, you know, we are reason the fans them want to understand where our journey are forward from. It's true. You know what I mean? Get was, 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 was uh, a wonderful experience with. As I say, me was the young sensation of people always I look forward to a journey for forward and the fashion, you see? And when we go, it's a great feeling, you see me? Because everybody always I look forward to me go up on the stage and um, it, it, it. So, summer season was 2018, you say, right? Yeah, and that was professionally and officially we can get in detail. How that connection did it make? Because some of is not a show you can just run up and, and just go perform. How, how did that, that connection they come out? Well, my, um, my sister Peach is Araba. She's an artist too. She gets that. Yeah. Because she was, she was in the, um, what you call it, the promotional team. You see me? Oh, she's part of the promotion team. Yes. Some of Sizzle. Yes, she gets a connection. Oh, okay. Get me. But it was a great look. It's... So literally what you say, um a she peaches call you out then. Yeah. Yeah, so walk me through it now, a journey man, walk me through it. You can't just say it was a great experience. We want to hear what happened. What what they are going through your head backstage. When you hear the crowd, when you see the crowd, when you name call, when you go up there. You have to walk with you. Right, walk well, with you it, the it's unbelievable, isn't it? When, when Peach is linked, man, she tell me, say, yo, bro, you know what she said, I get up on her show. Mm -hmm. so that. She said, she said, summer season, you dig? She said, yeah, summer season, I'll be in the man, bro. Big show. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I say, and she said, yeah. Isn't it? So I said, John, my sister, if you can't get up on her show, then I'm not willing to perform, man. Mm -hmm. And then I put myself together. The day come, I put myself together. Let me turn up. When I turn up at the show, me they, me they, me they, me they nervous as I'm a first. And them something I'm on earboard. Yeah, tell me about that. He kind of yeah. nervous because I see all like big artists. I say, yo, I do what I can match up to them. I have a profound side there, isn't it? Yeah. Did I think about it? I think about it. I think about it. Me, this is not just done the ID. You know, so here I pre. You know, I have to do it. You get me? Mm -hmm. They call me up on the stage. See it. Yo, I start to perform. Perform. I perform a true name. You opposite side. You might just start to perform you know, the crowd. Bro, get crazy, you dig? And this is 2018, right? 2018. Right, we're not 2021 now. Good. So that was like three years ago, two and a half years ago. Yeah, that time I'm first official. And then right after that, I do chill on the explosion. Now, how was the, how was the response from the crowd? Yeah, the response was great. As I said before, you cut me out a while ago. The response oh, okay. was great. crazy, you see me? And... I feel good in myself, the crowd ball for more tune, you know? Nice, nice, I nice. I did go for perform like one tune, because you don't know, say I say you want to sing up on stage. You know? I but the crowd say, oh, more tune. I mean, but for running next tune for your crowd, you know? I don't think they don't call me on them shit, man, and they say, yo, just in the work, you know? Big up King Bini, man, anyone been on earth. Is it? So, so basically then, Adaba is a family business then. Adaba Entertainment is a family business. Yeah, it's more like family, you get me? Well, I'm glad to hear that because most of the time when an artist is affiliated with a record label, they end up a problem because the love not really there. It's just about money and about business. You understand what I'm saying? Now, when you have do business with people who truly love you, it's yeah. it, it better. Because I can't tell any artist this or advise any artist this. The person with the most money is not always the best person for managing. Or the person with the most love for you 
are the best person for manager. Because that means they're not going to make no decision we are going to hurt the artist because they genuinely love the artist. But if it's only based upon money, they are going to make decisions based upon the money and not care about the well-being of the artist. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. No, so, I'm kind of glad to hear you say, it's a family oriented business because you say Peaches were your sister, she named Peaches Adaba, right? And then Adaba the labor, right? Yeah. So it's a family setting. Yeah. Well, most probably me never hear about um a journey until Adaba Entertainment approached me. But of course, you are gonna have everybody a bill until somebody know about them. See? So when me post you know, a lot of people reach out to me because they like the style and the flow we are DJ. So them accept say as a youth with talent. Now for those who out there we are watch the interview and the one I said, and who that put a hyper interview, which had tell them a little bit about a journey, personality and where you plan to go with the music, the direction and the vision where you have for your career and your music. Yeah, like I said, first of all, big up to who he did it before us. Like, I mean, in terms of the elders, we, we, we set the thing, we yeah. come add to it. Not create over or build something new. You get what I say? Come add to it. And creative. you understand the level of me, you see my foot A journey yeah. is that type of person, you get me? So, let me ask this now. You are not one of the artists that we're going to see now. When you perform your pants, the any and your boxers are sure and you bleach out and look distressing to the music. Me, 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 I know, I, you're not one of them type of artists. Me just an artist. I'm uh, asking for a friend. A journey. A journey. I just a journey. As a, as a name, as itself, my name, I'm a real name, you get me? So yeah. I'm, a Johnny, I'm, I'm a real name for my birth you get me? And that's me, you get me? Yeah, but we don't know you, so we are asking you, like, what would you expect from Ajani? Because we don't know who Ajani is. We are getting introduced to Ajani now. So, it's, as I'm DJ, well, we, we, we're, we're plan to come around the place. What we can expect? Just low natural vibes and positive energy. You get me what I say? Okay. So when I go see none of that underpants, something there, and no girl dressing on there, when I go see that? No, sir. No open and nose fuckery. Okay. Very good. <laughs> Very good. And that me one who can. We kind of afraid of artists, then we go that side there. Yeah, man. No straight near on them thing. Man. Okay. Okay. So, what's and next for Ajani right now? We know. We know you have the song named Luca. Cause that are the, the song where I pull the most traction right now based on where me observe. Zin? More your DJ piece of the song that make them hear with song. Yeah. Give me read him there. Give me Luca with him. Quick and fast. Give me Luca with him. Quick and fast. If you're not it, go a cappella, man. It's a live show. If you're not the rhythm, go a cappella. <laughs> yeah. I like the flow and the style of that song. From the first time I hear it, I like it. I like how you change up the flow of them and thing. No, and enough man, know, enough man I know who Lu Kang is, you know. Lu Kang is one of the famous martial arts star. Them. them man, they use him foot him kick you from now till next week. Why See? <laughs> them man, they're not good. Them man, they're not good with him, you know. And then they broke him foot them in dead. Him, no, no. him and them no good. <laughs> yeah, so from the ASM style, them a kick. Luke can no say, yo, in my research. In my research, you know where I go on. No joke. Yeah, yeah well. I'm going to follow the same way from, from, from Ajani. And other ones. Glenn Devon Records, likewise. They see me, Glenn Devon Records, a part of our family to see me. Yeah, big up Glenn Devon Records of England. You know the thing, go. Big up. You don't know the engineer and the whole of them up there. Cause when we're there in England, we go check them over the studio, over where car wash the. So you know what I'm saying? 
I'm a place, I'm a people them. So big up Glen Devon Records. So right now pandemic are going, you know. So no show now really key. What you do for stay relevant? Like what you do for sharp your talent? Like what a John you do in a regular day to day time now to keep himself relevant and keep him talent sharp. All right, you know me just stay in a, like in a studio, just focus more in the studio, focus me energy more in the studio. We can yeah, get that every day. I just them thing no focus that. No, no, no. If you want to read the article still, say, oh, we have Grammy. It takes up. Me, you know, I said, I'm not going to stop writing song until you get me find the Grammy song. I even when I find it, still not going to stop. I want Grammy. I want other boy entertainment. I play in the back. Well, brother, we wish you all the best, you know. And we know fight talent because you never know who will come around the place. And you have the talent. I mean, you sound good and you flow them sound good. But just wish you all the best and stay focused. And always remember, say, no matter how big you get or how international you go, you are a dancehall artist. Never lose the hardcore fundamental foundation, say. A dancehall, you do. Dancehall does not promote girl and girl. Dancehall does not promote man for man. Dancehall don't promote oral sex. Dancehall don't do them things. We want you to keep the fundamentals of this thing intact because probably the next year, six months, one year, two years, you are on the whole place. I'm one of the members say, me they tell you. Sure, you understand? Sure. So big up Ajani, big up Adaba Entertainment, all the best for 2021, 22, brother. Just keep strong. Go on the thing, Peaches, big up yourself, big up the whole team. You understand? The whole girl thing of you. You know what I'm saying? Bless up. up. You don't know it, go. Adaba. What you say? Me can't, me can't bless up the place before me cut. Yes, man. Yes, I, man. I run a little get to gospel. You dig what I say? Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> bless up. Bless up and give thanks to the future. Dance all forever. Adaba Entertainment, big up. Big up Ajani, people. You can follow him on Instagram at Ajani underscore Adaba, right? Holy. Yeah, so, big up everybody. We're tuning for the live. Bless up Ajani, bless up Adaba, no love. Yeah, enough respect, my G. Mm -hmm. Oh.